And this is my dad. He worked in the oil and gas plant. Hilda knew set this past. I was born in an oil camp in Venezuela. Made her future clear. The zip code that I live was one of the most polluted neighborhoods in uh, zip codes in Venezuela. She developed asthma as a child. Then her family moved to Colorado. My asthma has been terrible all week long. My mom trying to thrive, to look for all the different opportunities for our family and our community and our family really to thrive and realizing that we're moving to an area with just as bad air quality. Now she hopes her lived experiences will help others. As one of the state health department's newest health equity commissioners, Hilda says it's time to have a conversation about equitable environmental health. Like why is one neighborhood more polluted than another one? Like why is Commerce City, why is Elaria Swansea more polluted than all these other neighborhoods that Highlands Ranch. The poor air quality we've been talking about for weeks is nothing new to those neighborhoods near highways and industrial facilities. I think it's really interesting. Communities of color, low income communities are living in the front lines of environmental injustice and pollution are used to this kind of bad ozone days or, or bad haze days. In her new role, Hilda wants to help that change. She says the first step is elevating access to information for communities that need it most. Knowledge gives you the tools to fight for your people, for your family. Um, that's why I'm here. Victoria De Leon, Nine News.